Yoo-hoo! I'm Gary Faulkner, your go-to handyman. This got started from an article in GQ magazine written by a guy named Chris Heath, who profiled this guy, Gary Faulkner, who one day had a vision from God. Hello, Gary. I've got a favor to ask you, Gary. I need you to go over to Pakistan and capture Osama bin Laden for me. He is a construction worker out of Boulder, Colorado, who had this epiphany. They're botching off the plan to get bin Laden. And you throw in the element that this is meant to be a comedy. So we're good? You'll go to Pakistan and capture Osama bin Laden for me? If someone took seriously the notion that it is America's duty to bring about God's will, what you'd get is a madman going to Pakistan to kill Osama bin Laden. Gary is a larger-than-life kind of guy. You know, he lives life on the edge. He's somebody who doesn't seem to think before he does. Nothing good in the history of the world ever got done by thinking about it. You know, when he sets his mind to trying to do something, he's no is not the answer he's going to take. Son, I can do anything. I am Gary Faulkner. You know, and when I met him, I knew it was going to be like that. I said, oh boy, here we go. This is going to be nonstop talking. I don't know how he does it. And I asked him about it, he, but he loves to talk with everybody. He's an unlikely hero. He's a guy with no skills. He doesn't speak any languages. He doesn't know how to fight. He doesn't know how to communicate. He doesn't really have any money. He's just a guy. The idea that somebody like that actually exists that would want to go on these journeys to Pakistan and try and meet Osama bin Laden and bring him to justice is wild. I didn't make the rules, God did, but the plan is I'm thinking about buying a boat and sailing to Pakistan. Sailing to Pakistan. Anyone with a map knows that's not going to work. Pakistan is not accessible by boat because it's not got any water next to it. Looks like I'm still sailing. He tried the hang glide there. Here I come! He took the hang glider, flew right off the cliff into a tree trunk, and broke his ribs and smashed his watch. He's been there 11 times. And got as close to bin Laden as anyone did before SEAL Team 6 brought him down. Hello. I believe he eventually used an airline. You cannot take a sword onto an airplane. This is a real thing that happened. What's up, man? Yoo-hoo! I'm Gary Faulkner, your go-to handyman. Gary Faulkner. Marcy Mitchell. I had so many fantasies about you in high school. I must have gone through about 100 boxes of Kleenex. That is disgusting, but I'll take it! Hunter Bin Laden has been a cold well. They're botching off the plan to get Bin Laden. Sono toki kami ga eranda no wa ore datta. Hello, Gary. God, I've got a favor to ask you, Gary. A favor? I need you to go over to Pakistan and capture Bin Laden. Bin Laden? Of course. What's that? Buy a boat, sail to Pakistan, capture Osama Bin Laden. That's crazy. I'm pretty sure you can't fail to Pakistan. I'm sailing! Shit! Is this Pakistan? No, senor. Here I am, back on mission. Reason for visit? Taking care of business. An American samurai who is at loose in the slums of Islamabad. Ah! Who is the guy? We have no idea. Find out. Well, I love America. I love America too. Stere tsugiru wa ikoku oyaji no gyoten no jitsu wa konna ni korasu keiji mita koto nai. Time has come. The chief has arrived. Ore no emono wa Bin Laden. Stop the motherfucker.